Hello everyone, today I want to show you a quick trick of how to do VLOOKUP to the left with reversed column order. So actually I have done um, one of the uh, videos before. Um, it is actually using VLOOKUP with the if function with the, bra uh, the curly brackets. Uh, I'm going to do it with choose function this time and uh, I'll show you the difference. Like it's, there is slight difference, but then at the end of the day, it does the same thing. So as a recap for the if function, um, if let's say this is our database, um, this is our employee names to the right. And then we want to do the reverse. We look up and look up for their uh, performance rating. Uh, in this cell. So with the if function, what we would do is actually you go for we look up, you look up the name, um, and then you go for the if function with a curly, uh, well, with a round bracket, and then the curly bracket with zero uh, comma one uh, and the bracket, and then you choose the ranges from left to right. So for example, uh, you want to look for the performance rating, so choose that. Um, <clears throat> comma and then go for the names and then close the bracket and then go to uh, exact match and then you get two right so um, we're looking for Abraham Lincoln and then the performance rating is two that is how we get to there with the choose function it's slightly different so what we, you would still do is like we look up the name the cell that you want to look up go for choose function uh, go for curly bracket, but then go with one and two this time, close it. And then you actually select the range from the right to the left. So you would go with the uh, columns that you want to look up the name for, uh, which is usually the column to the right. And then you go for the range uh, on the left, which is performance rating, which is the, the value that you want to look for. And then you close bracket and then go by two and then close bracket and then uh, zero. And then here we go. So that is how you look up uh, with the choose function. So you can tell that, let's say if I change this to uh, Winston Churchill, the number should change to four. And then let's do that. And then you can see exactly um, showing the same results. So basically those two functions uh, are doing the same thing, but like I'm just showing you um, a different method uh, just to be fun. Okay, that's all that I want to share to you today. Hope you, uh, you'll find it helpful. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to my channel if you like it. If you have any question, please leave me a comment and I will talk to you very soon.